Welcome everyone, this is Jim Todd with Song Surgeon and in today's weekly video tip, I'm going to show you how this uh, automatic updater in Song Surgeon works. Right now it's sort of a semi-automatic updater. We haven't implemented it to be fully automatic because we wanna make certain all the bugs are out of it. But if you go ahead and download the, the most recent build, which is uh, 0048 on Windows or 0049 on Mac, you will have this updater built into it. You go to the Help button. You go to the selection here to update Song Surgeon. <clears throat> it will do a check and it will come back and say your machine is running the most recent build of Song Surgeon. And that would be correct because this is the build that has the uh, updater in it. When the next build comes out and then you run this, it will find the next build and it will prompt you to download it. And essentially what it does is instead of uninstalling and reinstalling, it will essentially grab the file or files that have been changed, put them on your machine, and there's no need to uninstall, reinstall, and go through all of that monkey business. So th that's the idea and the purpose for having this particular updater. So that's the first step. Now let me just pause a second and then show you what it looks like when you actually go through the update. Okay, so I made some changes on the server now to mimic as if there were an upgrade available. Let's show you what this looks like then when you go through the steps. Help, update Song Surgeon. An update is available. Do you want to install it now? I click yes. It downloads the update. And it works the same way on a Mac, essentially. You just follow the steps and it'll walk you through it. And when you're done, you should have the most recent version downloaded. And when you click the icon, it should open it up and it should run. Okay, so the update was downloaded successfully. Please close Song Surgeon by clicking the X button in the upper right hand corner. Once Song Surgeon is closed, please click Apply. Okay, so close the program first. Click Apply. It says Update Successful. Song Surgeon has been successfully updated on your computer. If for some reason this new version doesn't work correctly, you can roll back to your older version by going to the Help button, Roll Back, or Start button. Program Song Surgeon SS Updater. So the message was saying that if for some reason the update didn't work correctly on your machine, you could go to the Help button, go to the Rollback Last Song Surgeon Update, you could select this option, and it would essentially restore the previous version you had. At some point in the not too distant future, what we hope to do is to um, have Song Surgeon automatically check for updates every time you open it. So if there is an update available, it will prompt you and allow you to choose yes or no. But for right now, we're going to have this sort of in this semi-manual or semi-automatic fashion, whichever you prefer by asking you to go here. So that will conclude this weekly video tip on Song Surgeon. Thanks for watching.